Constance from the Rock Springs Library, and we are officially back with some more Create with Constance, where we take a look at the nominees for the Wyoming Book Awards, I give a quick synopsis, and then we create a craft based on the book. Now, just as a refresher, the Wyoming Book Awards is a special award where a collection of titles are selected and you, the reader, gets to decide on the best. You can find all of the nominees at your local library where they are separated into three categories based on grade level. You can also find most of the titles available on Overdrive, which you can find on our website and access using your library card. Now this is for individuals from K to 12, and in order to participate, you have to read three titles within your age group and then vote on your favorite. After voting, you will receive a special gift from Papa Murphy's. Now back to today's video. For today, we will be looking at the book Front Desk by Kelly Yang. Now this is a chapter book that follows Mia, a 10-year-old Chinese-American immigrant girl who runs a motel with her family. Based in the 90s, this book allows readers to follow along and experience some of the challenges that immigrant families face when trying to make it in America. The story is actually modeled after some of the situations the author experienced while growing up in America. There are definitely some highs and lows to this moving story, but I recommend giving it a shot. For today's project, we will be creating our very own mini journal, just like from the story. All you will need is a blank piece of paper, scissors, a pencil with an eraser, a black marker, and something to color with. Now that we have all of our supplies, let's learn how to make our very own DIY mini journal. All right, so for this project, the first thing we're going to do is fold our paper in half hamburger style. And next we're going to fold it in half again, but hot dog style. Now after we've done that, we are going to flip our paper and we're going to take each of the short sides and fold them to the middle line. Now when you look at your paper from the side, it should make a W shape. So next, we are going to close it all up and from here, we are going to cut along this line. So here's our cut. And you're just going to take these two sides, open them like that, and then your paper should look like an X. From there, just collapse your pages down. And now you have a booklet. Next, using your pencil, go ahead and draw a design, and if you want, you can even color it in. So here's our booklet, and if you want, you could even do this with a second piece of paper to make your journal a little bit bigger. All you will do is take the second booklet and just place it inside at the midpoint. And if you have a stapler, you can go ahead and staple along the edge. Once you've done that, you're done. today's video. I hope you guys all enjoyed making your very own journal. Feel free to share your creations with us on Facebook and while you're at it, go ahead and check out what other fun things we have going on at all three of the libraries. As always guys, stay safe, stay healthy, and we'll see you back here again for some more Creative Constance. Bye!